come to the Corniche and you don't capture the beautiful sunset, that's not possible. Aladdin movie is being played inside in the open air cinema by movie. So as you can see the organizers are here. The tournament is gonna start after Maghrib prayers. Hi people, finally I'm here at the sports sport district at Jeddah waterfront where Jeddah season is being held. Uh, for those of you who are not aware of the district itself, this is on the North Corniche side, uh, right in front of Al Bilad Hotel and Sheraton. So let's see what we have over here. So I'm heading to the street ball tournament area, street basketball tournament area in the sport district seems quite impressively built so let's see what the location is all about so this is where uh, they are hosting the three on three street basketball tournament and as you can see it's a pretty well built facility uh, for a three on three basketball tournament so as you can see the organizers are here the tournament is going to start after Maghrib prayers it's a very good setup and the location is just mesmerizing right at the waterfront with such cool music in the background amazing and you can see the Avengers look alike building uh, in the back Bentley being displayed that they have uh, shuttle services to other districts on waterfront but not only that uh, if you want to uh, make your trip from Red Sea Mall all the way here and back you can do that too because there are buses coming to and from Red Sea Mall Basically, lounge by Oro. Beautiful, simply beautiful. You can just can't believe it. You're in Jeddah. Do you see the light? And this is basically the Beaches District, which is district number seven, seven and eight. Beaches District is quite impressive because you have all these cafes, restaurants. Uh, even in the sports district, yes, you will find uh, restaurants and all, but they are mostly kiosks. If you're looking for a very good uh, dining setup uh, that's giving you a beautiful view of uh, Jeddah's coast, uh, then I would recommend you guys come to the Beaches District, which is district number 7. Uh, 
really impressed. Aladdin movie is being played inside in the open air cinema by movie. One interesting insight and that is that uh, movie cinemas on Jeddah waterfront they are just showing uh, limited movies like one Egyptian movie and the other one is Aladdin uh, and you cannot book their tickets online because this is a tempor temporary facility and uh, but they are going to be opening soon a permanent cinema in Mall of Arabia. because you have this uh, very expensive uh, fine dining Spanish restaurant Asador de Aranda and uh, sorry I couldn't get the uh, proper view of it but if you go from one to all the way all the way to district number three you're gonna find mostly uh, food uh, it's more of a food court kind of thing but the real interesting stuff starts to happen after district number three because you have like uh, all those cafes lounges uh, right on the coast and uh, the open air cinema and sports district you just name it district one is a bit interesting because it says that it's pulse district why are they naming it so you've got food trucks plaza you've got amphitheater you got the famous barcelonian restaurant asador de aranda you've got dj square uh, okay there's a cl oh, okay. clinic and toilets the so this is where you have the food trucks, not a lot, but still. And this here is the amphitheater, which is hosting musicians. One of them is Marwan Khori, uh, then another Turkish uh, artist. So this is how it's going. So when you're here in district number one, and you want to dine at uh, Asador de Aranda, uh, you just need to keep walking by the side of the amphitheater and it's all the way at the end there you can see you can miss the sign along with the beautiful sea coast so I'm gonna be walking in traditional Spanish cuisine but the thing that makes this place really special is the view because while you're dining here you're getting the view of the Red Sea straight away yeah. okay. this is our main course are the roasted baby lamb roasted? roasted baby lamb sir beautiful yes and this is basically all traditional Barcelonian cuisine yes sir thank you So as you can see, it's a beautifully designed setup and I think this is the star attraction when you're in this district. A very Barcelonian look and feel. What an evening this has turned out to be. Uh, now here are some tips. When you want to experience the entire Jeddah season, you don't need to take your car all the way to each and every district that's involved. Because Jeddah season, the main attraction is Jeddah waterfront, Cornish al Hamra, and the historic district, which is near Balad. What you can do is you can simply come to the Jeddah waterfront, park your car anywhere, behind Sheraton Hotel, Al Bilad Hotel or uh, uh, the Waldorf Astoria, Hilton. You just park your car wherever you find it convenient and then you simply come to the waterfront, check out the open air cinema or the uh, beach cafes and then 
when you feel like going to the historic district what you're gonna do is simply you need to take a yellow bus now these yellow buses are not taking you uh, from each and every stop to a specific location like if you want to go to the Red Sea Mall you need to grab the bus from district number nine which is the sports district but if you want to go to uh, the historic district and Colonial Alhambra then you need to come all to uh, district number seven which is the beaches entertainment district uh, really exciting really good please pay a visit to Jeddah season all these three locations my next vlog is going to be about uh, the historic district so hope you guys really had a good time watching this and i hope to see you soon thanks the bus system that takes you from one district to the other is really good it saves you a lot of walking because Jeddah waterfront is a huge area and these small buses these small posters that you see that are branded with Jeddah season they take you from one district all the way to the other uh, whether you want to go from district 1 to district 3, district 2 or all the way back to district 9. So a very good system. Nobu Fine Dining Restaurant. that has these tulips on 